Well, I'll be if I ain't been working all week down in southern Louisiana where it's been hotter than, you know. It's been hotter than them two rats right there in that wool sock. I can tell you that. But uh, I got a box in from Nick the other day. I'm just now getting around and doing the video. Uh, he threw a bunch of goodies in, in, the, in the thing like he always does. I uh, got a couple of uh, carabiners from Urban Gear. Those uh, few knives. That's, I don't, I, I'm not familiar with much of this. Yeah, CRKT something. Before we get into all that stuff, man, they, they sent some lube. I want to thank Mr. Uh, Mr. Nick. He sent this. You probably, I think you've already seen this in a video by the time this uploads. Uh, I used it in one of the videos. I've, I've had these things in a cart so many times and just forget about them. They just expire. <laughs> but uh, yeah, I, I, I like having these little knife stands around. I, I very much appreciate him sending that along. Tonight's video is going to be about these two rats here, or at least one of them. Um, what is that? I'll be damned. That's what they was doing in that wool sock. Anyway, all right. So that's a rat number two. I come by, Mister. Come by way of Mister. Edward as well. Before we get and talk about these knives, that's D and K knives. It's a sticker that that Nick sent along. That's Don Farmer. Uh, he's a sales representative for uh, D and K knives. I'm not affiliated. Nick has a link, I believe it's behind the edge 10. Uh, if that's not right, get with Nick. But that'll get you 10% off of your orders. How about Miss Alley Cord, Paracord? Superb lady in the community. Does great stuff with Paracord. This is some of her stuff and her contact information. If you need some Paracord stuff, pause the screen, check her out. All right, Nick, dude. Thanks for all this stuff, man. For real. He let me borrow a rat too. Uh, this is a, a D2 model. We already had this one, which is the S35VN model. Uh, and this one is the OS8 model. I will switch these back around just to, the, there won't be any confusion. Cause like this is the red rat that should have the S35VN blade. I've been working the ever loving dog mess out of this knife i haven't cleaned it up duty dagger said it would make my my knives look better if whenever i use them i didn't clean them and uh i figured i'd give that a shot now the truth is is that i ain't had time to like take a break i've got tape stuck to this thing um it's tuesday i got a long week ahead of me and i've already put in almost 40 hours so uh that being said we're gonna get a similar edge on all three of these knives. I've also got another rat to around here somewhere in all eight. So uh, we're gonna compare all the knives performance and we'll we'll see how good this S35VN really is as far as an upgrade from the D2 or the all eight model. I'm gonna go ahead and let you know right now, this thing is performing stellar. I think before uh, Nick sold it to me that he probably put an edge on it. It don't look like a factory edge and the edges well, it was good i haven't touched it i have worked it i've worked it hard it's it's done very well uh so the videos on on the performance will be coming up want me tonight it's a midnight special video it's, it's kind of letting you know what's going on going on in the in the upcoming future so we're going to keep this video nice and short when it gets hot outside watch out for your wool socks Rats eat them up. If y'all ain't got any other questions, we'll catch you on the flip side.